Hello, uh, Year 7. Um, I hope you're going well and uh, you can get some work done. Just please remember what I said. We need to get in a habit. We need to get our work done for all our subjects and we need to just do a little bit each day and make the effort and you'll find you'll get through this time okay. Last week we finished off on this slide and I explained to you that you should make three columns and put in uh, three different emojis because we were looking at uh, the idea of similar products and describing them and understanding how we could use them. So that was where we sort of finished up at the end of the last video, um, uh, which I said was slide number 11. And so now we need to move on to some new work this week. So uh, we'll do this slide, uh, which is designed for manufacturing research. And so what I'd like you to do is to um, start a new slide. Um, and on that new slide, the reason I'm asking you to start a new page is we need to do some research a little bit about what design for manufacturing is and into um, the process of making our emoji uh, before we finish off this sheet. But we can um, also um, list some of the limitations as we can do on this side. We've already done that. That's This is like a summary of your, of your work. And then um, list some of the features for Gravit, which you've already learned about. So the new page that I want you to make up um, is here. So I want you to start a new slide and, and um, it's part of your investigation. And I want you to define and explain um, the idea of what design for manufacture is. Okay, um, And then to type that in. Um, then you also need to uh, work, uh, do some research on circuit cutters and to find out a little bit about how circuit cutters, vinyl cutters work. So watch some videos, do a search in um, YouTube called vinyl cutters or circuit cutters and have a look at them and then just describe briefly how that works. Uh, maybe throw in a picture or two, summarize that and that'll be fine. So then you can come back to this page and you can describe the process so far, so what we uh, what we did, what we learn about, how we learn it, and uh, do I understand um, communication, for instance, in a, in a different way. So that's uh, sheet 12, and we're adding another sheet there. We're not going to do emotive charades as such, but I am going to do it in another manner. So there's a second task that I've put in here for you. So in your Google uh, Classroom, there is now a... Um, a post called Emotive Charades and in there I've asked you to take two still pictures of yourselves, a selfie if you like, uh, but showing a particular emotion. Okay, And then you should upload it into here and then uh, you should do that at least uh, twice, two, two different pictures of yourself and then uh, I want you to comment on three other people's photos. Okay, So um, try to guess what we're doing here is we're playing a game, we're guessing what the other person's emotion is. And then what you can do is you can use those images that you that you post up there to move on to this next slide. And you can uh, put those cut and paste your emoji charade pictures in here. And also the results, see if, you know, the results would be, did people understand what my um, face was? No, it didn't, etc. Okay, so we're going to play that game. You'll upload those things in here, and then we will uh, summarize the results from that on this page. The last thing we'll get you to do this week is to basically finish off Criterion A, and we'll do some design work uh, next week. Okay, we'll start into design work uh, straight away, but we'll just finish off this one. You'll come to this last page here, and you'll get these lines of inquiry suggestions from way back up at the top of the assignment um, here where we're saying uh, you know here's our task and here's our inquiry questions and these are the inquiry questions we've listed so look at those again and try and link them now into uh, into here in terms of our lines of inquiry uh, you can guess that if you need to it'll be interesting to see what you say and and what you're learning and then we're summarizing our research the key points from our inquiry so far we can get it into here um, and then we'll be ready next week to uh, to go ahead and um, and work on our designs so please work hard um, and then I'll be able to send an email home to your parents saying you're doing good work and um, get in a routine and good luck <laughs>